A call for more volunteer firefighters. The Firemen's Association of the State of New York went to several different fire departments today, urging people to consider signing up. The Cicero Fire Department, one of them, members with FASNI, say the numbers for volunteer firefighters have declined year after year. A local fire chief explains why these departments are so vital to the community. Each and every day, we face challenges, and without the citizens to get involved, these departments are going to fail. And none of us want any of our organizations to fail. So this is a plead for each citizen. Find what you can do, get involved in your community, and please come out this weekend and tour the firehouses or go virtually to see what they have to offer you. Job for everybody. And you can participate virtually or in person. The link to sign up is at localsyr.com. And that push for more firefighters is really important in more rural areas, especially much of Oswego County. News Channel 9's Adrian Smith hears from the county's fire coordinator on how they're trying to adapt to meet that crucial need. This is one of the helmets that I used to wear in the burn building when we were doing that type of training. Nowadays, it's rare you'll come across someone like Don Forbes. He's a fourth generation firefighter serving his community for almost 50 years. It's hard to come up with, you know, what's going to create that light to come on and say, I want to volunteer. But as the fire coordinator of Oswego County, he and many others are trying to spark a fire in people to volunteer. Right now, we're at a very critical spot with volunteers, not just Oswego County, everywhere in New York State, everywhere in the country. Across Oswego County, there's a total of 34 stations, 32 volunteer, and two career departments. But the size of each crew varies tremendously. We end up calling where we might be able to handle a, a moderate sized fire with our what we call first alarm automatic, which would be three departments total. Um, today, a lot of departments end up going to their second alarm so that they bring more manpower. So we're using twice as many departments to get the same number of people to be able to handle the situation. Across the state, the average person now stays with a fire department for about five to seven years. And the departments, they aren't necessarily looking for a veteran, but they're looking for someone who can dedicate as much time as they possibly can. When I started as a firefighter volunteering, it was you donated whatever time it took to do whatever needed to be done. Today, people say, I can give you 10 hours a week. Whatever time they can give, is better than no time at all. And he's hoping more answer that call in Oswego County and beyond. Adrian Smith, News Channel 9. And for the past two years, the Oswego County Fire Advisory Board has been coming up with better ways for recruitment and retention. Forbes says they're looking at a potential paid on-call option for crew members in the future.